Hi, Gemini. This is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of December 6, 2021. Thank you guys for stopping by. Um, don't forget JackieTomlin.com if you're seeking a psychic reading. Okay, for this week, it's a week of fear and worries leaving. You're really pushing forward in a positive light. You're under the era of a new beginning um, and expect new opportunities. I want to also throw out a Scorpio. May or may not resonate with some of you guys. Some secrets could be revealed to you this week. And there, you're going to hear some endings or somebody in some trouble with the law or something like that. That is definitely present. So let's take a look. We're looking at Gemini. This is your week of December 6, 2021. And your first card up, we start with the Pope, which in this deck is kind of the same as the Emperor. This is someone, a dominant, prominent type person, someone coming in, like to save the day for you guys. Okay. And we have the Two of Swords. And Two of Swords says you guys have been putting things off for way too long. It's now time to uh, make decisions. And we have the Nine of Swords. Be warned of your immune system. It's their plan to stay. For some of you also, it could be stress and just a generalized lack of sleep. Okay? And we have the Three of Swords. Three of Swords. Third person, unwanted advice and or opinions. Uh, Gemini, particularly my singles, if you are involved with someone, please make sure you're not in a third-party situation. And then we have the Six of Swords, Son of the Reading. Leaving the travel waters, heading off into the calm. For some of you, it's future travel plans as well. But, but basically, you're leaving the past behind. You're moving forward in a very positive light. I have the Eight of Cups here. Eight of Cups, total happiness, total contentment. Um, something in the past, Gemini, no longer serves a purpose to you, and you're turning your back and walking away from that. Two of Cups, date night, happy union, things are going well in the love life. With the Knight of Swords, quick moving energy, and what is rushing in with that? The Seven of Pentacles, working and gaining. Now, this could also indicate to me raises, promotions uh, for some of you, bonus checks and or commissions, okay? So, things are going well at work for you guys. Extra money for some of you could be a side hustle or a second job coming in. So, let's clarify these. And on top of the Pope up here, what do we have there? We have the Queen of Wands energy. Queen of Wands coming in with an Aries type temperament. Someone grand, grounded and centered. Someone there to support you or lift you up or offer their assistance. On that Two of Swords energy, I have a major arcana of strength. Strength on your side no matter what you do. Okay. And then on that Six of Swords, we have Temperance. Sagittarius energy. Love this. Temperance says... You know, you, act, you acknowledge and embrace that when you do the same things, you get the same results. Therefore, you're changing things up. Changing things up leads you to something better. And then we have the Three of Swords. Three of Swords followed up with the Ten of Wands. Ten of Wands, you're overcoming. You're reaching your goals. You're pushing your obstacles to the side. You're making a better path. You're making a new path. You're making that path on up towards that castle. Love that. On the Six of Swords energy. You guys have the Ace of Cups. Your new beginning here the week of the Six is going to be in love. And on the Eight of Cups. There is that five of swords. You're defensive. You're guarded. Okay. You're not approachable. I guess is what I want to say. Let your guard down. I don't see any reason for you to be as guarded as what you are. On the two of cups energy. Again, Sagittarius has appeared here with the page of wands and the messenger card. That message is the two of pentacles. It's letting you know if you are juggling right now financially, it's going to be brief and passing. There is money coming in that is going to set everything straight. And on that seven of pentacles energy, I have the ace of swords. Your next new beginning of the week of the six. It's in communication. 
how you communicate with people, how people communicate with you. And, you know, it's holiday season. There is going to open up some communications with people from the past. But let me say this. Anyone we're opening up communication with Gemini is someone that you are glad to reconnect with. Bonus card for the center of your reading. You've got the Knight of Pentacles. There's the money. There's the good business deal. It's going to come rushing in when you least expect it. But bottom line is letting you know, financially, you're going to be okay. So, thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful week ahead. I will see you soon. JackieTomlin.com for psychic readings.